She was born, like most of us, by accident in 1955, which makes her quite an old lady. I like to give, if possible, deep offence. <laughs> I don't like to admit it's a family show, but if the thing that brought them together was crack. Have you heard of that? <laughs> what, crack? Cocaine? Crack. It, no, no. Carpenter's crack. Oh. Because he was, he was bending over, fixing this picture. And her eye fell on that little groove. <laughs> Down that, you stand and tremble. Indeed. It's a decision I'd recommend to any woman watching. I put my family last. <laughs> yes. The whistle and smack of a gladi, sometimes the thrilling tinkle of a contact lens. The gynecologist had gone, gone over me. <laughs> yes, that's all. And uh, gave me the thumbs up, as a matter of fact. <laughs> I'm wearing special surgical gloves. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Which had only been used once before for an operation. <laughs> so you stand and tremble that badly. Ah! That was a tragic case of gladiolus interruptus, I'm afraid. So this woman got a real berating from Edna for wearing sunglasses indoors at night. <laughs> and at the end of the show, she asked her little uh, friend to come up on stage and take a bow. Edna said, I'm sorry, I might have been a little bit implied to you. And only when the woman stood up and produced the white stick. Uh -huh. <laughs> Let your gladi be drawn to mine. You, you, no you, you, him, him. Let it be attracted. Come on. Wave that 